if you have taken math in A levels or are considering it and you have no idea what papers you have to give and what P1, P3, M1, S2 mean, then this video is for you. So A levels is usually done in two years. The first year is referred to as AS or A1. The second year is called A2. As far as A level math is concerned, there are altogether four papers, also known as components, that you need to give in order to clear the subject. Now, in A level math, you altogether have six papers and you have to give paper one, which is pure math one. This is usually referred to as P1 and paper three, which is pure math three, referred to as P3. Along with these two, you have to give two from the following three. Number one, mechanics, which is paper four, also known as M1. Then you have probability and statistics one, which is paper five, also known as S1. Then you have probability and statistics two, which is paper six, also known as S2. Now the question here is, how do you decide which components to give? If you're giving it through a school, they probably have decided that for you. If they haven't, or if you're a private student and you're wondering what to do, here are your options. In year one, you can give P1 and along with that, you can either give M1 or S1. In year two, if you've given M1, then you can only give S1. And if you've given S1 in the first year, then you can give M1 or S2. One thing to keep in mind is that you can't give M1 and S2 because S1 is a prerequisite of S2. So if you don't know which components to choose, then the best thing to do is to give S1 in the first year. Why? Because then you will have the option of either giving M1 or S2 the following year. So that's it, fellas. I hope you got value out of this video. And if you did, make sure to like it and subscribe to the channel in case you haven't done that yet. And share this video with whoever you think can possibly benefit from it. Take care. Bye.